One of the ironies of gardening is that often some of the smallest pests can create the biggest nuisance. Let me give you an example. I know this little angel's trumpet doesn't look like much now. It's because it's just getting over an infestation of white flies. But if you could have seen it last year, it was spectacular. It was covered with these long peach colored trumpet shaped blossoms and the foliage was a rich green. As you can see, the white flies have just about drained all of the life out of this little plant. You can see the evidence of their damage in the lack of vigor in the plant and the discoloration of the leaves. Before they were a rich green and now they've turned the sickly yellow. You can tell that you have white flies by doing a simple test. Just shake the foliage and if a cloud of white insects fly out, then you've spotted the culprit. I was able to get this infestation of white fly under control with repeated applications of an insecticidal soap. Now, for this to work best, you'd really need to soak the underside of the leaves and the top of the plant all the way down to the base. My second line of defense is to use these sticky white fly traps. You see, the color yellow is attractive to white flies and other insects, so they're drawn onto it, stick, and eventually die. Now, you can pick these up at your local garden center, and they're easy to apply. If you'd like more information on earth-friendly and safe ways to deal with pests in your garden, just check out our website. From the garden, I'm Alan Smith. If you'd like more information on this topic or any other gardening topic, just check out my website, pallensmith.com.